Oh my gosh. Okay, it's in the office. The tornado is in the office. No worries, folks. I'm going to shut the door and everything is going to be okay. Did a car just land outside? All right, here I am once again in the wonderful world of Teardown, and today we're going to be seeing what happens when a tornado hits a skyscraper. So here we are on a fairly popular map. This one's been out for quite a while, and if you want to download any of the maps I use in this video, links will be in the description. Now these buildings are primarily made of wood. You can see these two are pretty much completely made out of wood, and then we have a brick building here. So I'm very interested to see what happens when the tornado comes through and what type of damage we're going to see. And I'm expecting there's going to be a lot of carnage. Now here we are in one of the buildings. They do have working elevators. And you can actually hear it going right now. So we'll just wait for the elevator. There we are. We can step on in. We also have an emergency stop. So um, if you do that, you're sort of trapped. But uh, I know another way out. There we go. Now a lot of the rooms in these buildings do not have furniture. But... We just happen to be in one that does. And you can see this is what the furniture looks like. We've got a TV. We've got a couch. We've got different rooms. These are bedrooms here. And, uh, yeah, I wonder what the tornado is going to do with all that stuff. It's probably going to pull it right through the wall. But there's only one way to find out. So first, I'm just going to watch the tornado go through from, like, an aerial view. Oh, we had an explosion there. All right, we're getting a little bit of lag, but... Luckily, it's not too bad. Oh my gosh. Now we're getting a lot of lag. That whole building is being shredded. You can see, basically, it's like being in a blender, that building there. It's just being torn to shreds, and mostly because it's made out of wood. You can see we've got... What is that? It looks like possibly a container there. And all of the internal parts of the building just being spewed out. The tornado is coming this way. Oh my gosh. What was that? Is this a washer? I think it is. Now, I've actually made the tornado a bit smaller from the last video. If you haven't seen that, a link will be in the top right corner. But, uh, yeah, it saves on performance because there's a lot of particles here. And, uh, there we go. The tornado has now made its way through the town, so let me despawn this. Now, if you want to copy any of the settings, they are here, so you can pause the video and take a look at that. But let's despawn. There we go. So, here we have the path. It actually tore the asphalt from the road. So that's pretty crazy. So you can see the building got cut like a cake. You can see all the layers inside all the floors. And wow, I would not want to be in this building when the tornado went through. We've got a car here. What's left of a car? Ouch. That does not look good. But luckily, my vehicle looks relatively unscathed. All right, I'm back. The buildings are refurbished. Let's go ahead. Let's go into this building and find a hiding space. So, of course, if we want to be safe, we want to be at the lowest part of the building, near a structural support or the innermost walls. This hallway looks pretty good. We might be able to hunker down right here. I can hear the winds outside, which is always a bit spooky. Oh, I hear damage. Uh-oh, it's getting a lot louder. Let's get over here. Oh my gosh, it's here. Holy cow. All right, it is going right through the lobby right now. Oh my gosh. So, I'm pretty sure the whole building is being shredded. And just like we saw before, basically blended into tiny chunks. So that's why it's lagging so bad. And yeah, it most certainly is because there's nothing left. All right, there is now debris raining down. Oh my gosh. Now, one interesting thing to point out. This area right here is where I was hiding. So if I stayed there when I despawned the tornado, I would most certainly be dead. Because, well, I mean... It's burning and just a debris pile. All right, so here we are at the next map. This is the office night shift, but I've made it day so we can see everything. And uh, yeah, it is a not so tall office building, but it does have several floors and a lot of details. So let's go on inside and you know what? Let's make a grand entrance. So let me just quickly back up here. Here we go. And there we are, perfect. All right, there we go. The tornado is spawned. We're going to seal the door there. And if we turn off the lights, the tornado might not see us. So far, so good. Oh, maybe not. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the tornado is currently decimating the outside of the building. Uh-oh, the door just ripped off. Oh, my gosh. All right, we're about to be inside the tornado right now. Here we go. This is it. Oh, my gosh. The bathroom stalls are being ripped to shreds. Luckily, the sinks are holding. The roof is not looking so good. I can see the framework 
in the floor there. It's trying to suck me out. Oh, it just did. It blew out the wall behind me. All right, I'm being lofted up to the ceiling. Oh, wow, that is not good. I should not be able to see light out the ceiling. All right, here we are with the aftermath of the tornado. And uh, that was definitely a wild ride for sure. You know, I want to do this again because that was really fun. So, uh, yeah, let's respawn. All right, here we go. Spawning the tornado, and let's go find a hiding place inside the building. Now, in a real tornado situation, you would want to get down on one of the lower floors like I did. Didn't really work out so well. What I am going to do is I'm going to get rid of all of the stuff that can move around in here so I don't get killed by any of it. Is the tornado at the building yet? Um, it's right next to that car. Oh, wow. Okay, well, the car is gone. Um, I'm pretty sure this office is about to... Well, explode. Oh my gosh. Okay, it's in the office. The tornado is in the office. No worries, folks. I'm going to shut the door and everything is going to be okay. Did a car just land outside? Yes, it did. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this is not good. Here we go. This is it. Uh-oh. Things are starting to float. Here we go. We are entering the tornado right now. All the lights just went out. Holy cow, the floor is gone. I'm getting pulled towards the opening in the floor. Here we go. Yep, I'm in the tornado. That is the center of the tornado there. And I just got hit by something. I am being lifted. All right, there we go. Excellent. The tornado is now gone. Well, folks, this seems to be some sentient being which has formed out of the carpet from one of the offices. I'm not sure what it's doing or to be honest, what it wants, but I'm pretty sure it is definitely a new form of species. All right, I think for the betterment of mankind, I'm gonna put that out of its misery. All right, so here we have Caldera Tower. This is one of the most impressive tower maps I have seen, and we're gonna go ahead and we are gonna hit it with the tornado, and we're gonna see what happens. But let's take a little tour of the inside of the building. Now, I've chosen the version without any shadows, and that's just to avoid extra lag. But I highly recommend you check this out. It is a super high-quality build, and there's a lot of individual settings you can play around with. So, um, yeah. Okay, so there's a tornado. It is approaching. So let's go ahead and let's go inside. Now, where to hide? There's a lot of objects that are probably going to get slung around, which is always a little bit concerning. But I think it's too late now because the tornado is literally right out in front of the building. Oh my gosh, here we go, folks. This is it. Caldera Tower is being hit by the tornado. Oh my gosh. Okay, get into the center part of the building by the elevators. That is my goal. Here we go. There's a lot of noises going on. Oh my gosh. Oh, that door is doing something funky. All right, we are in the tornado. Or should I say the tornado is in the building? Yeah, now we're starting to feel the effects of that lag. It is tearing this building apart. The tornado is currently working its way through the actual tower part of the building and now going into the bank section. We've got a bank down there, so the tornado is making quick work of those spaces right now. And I'm very interested to see the aftermath. Oh boy, here we go. Now we're starting to have debris rain down. Oh my gosh, there's a fire door raining down. Where did that come from? Wow, okay, we got a giant chunk ripped out of the building. And oh, I see where those fire doors came from. Holy cow. Surprisingly, the tornado didn't do anything here. But as soon as it entered the building, I mean, it just decimated it. All right, so I think that's going to be a video right there. If you want to check out the mod, the tornado mod or the maps I used, down the links will be in the description. So yeah, if you guys have enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and a comment, and I'll see y'all next time, guys. Goodbye.